as I'm on this train to Milan, I've seen a lot. I've seen lots and lots of Instagram posts claiming that Milan has no Italians. It's all Africans and Arabs and immigrants. So we're gonna go there, and try to find out, see if there's any immigrants there, or is it? Or do you think? In, do you think Instagram's lying? Because they said the same thing about Barcelona and Spain, but I don't know. I've seen a lot of Spanish people in Spain, no? Yeah, but we're gonna go to Milan and find out is it filled with immigrants or Italians? But look at this. Look at this, eh, son? We're on the train, we're ready to go. Let's go check out Milano. So far, I've seen about one Italian, five Africans, and about ten other kinds of immigrants, plus us two travelers. <laughs> so it's looking, it's looking like Instagram is telling the truth. We're gonna check it out. Let's go see if we can catch some scams too. The girls with the white mask, you know, the ones that think that you're taking a picture and then they make you pay like 20 euros let's go check those guys out too why not scams and immigrants let's do it it's Italy it's Milan it's the north there's actually been a lot of talk about this on the news that Europe is going through a war an invasion uh, a silent invasion and uh, they're accepting all these immigrants and they're slowly destroying the countries like in France or Italy this is top discussion, this is real discussion, and everybody's saying this is a big problem because they're all coming here, even for them. They're coming here and they're not getting job opportunities, so they have to resort to scamming people or stealing because they need to eat. And they're not being accepted by the society here. So we're gonna check it out, see if this is another country that has fallen, and see if it's true. I know Croatia, it's not true, everybody's living together and being nice but let's go see if milan is true this is a different kind of video i think so far here in milan there's tons of security tons of security tons of the military checking people's ids randomly checking them for whatever they got searching them and we didn't bring ids we left them in bergamo so hopefully we don't get pinched here with no IDs. Look how beautiful this place is. We're going to the metro now. We're on our way to Duomo. But look at this. Wow. So far, it's mad mixed. Let's go. So far, it is mad mix of people here. You can definitely see that there's lots of Lots of immigrants. There we go. See? So the first kind of scam, kind of weird thing is this guy will offer you like uh, popcorn kernels. And he'll be like, here, here for your kid, here. Here's this guy right here in the green toque. And he'll give it to you to throw it to the birds. And then my guess would be he charges you, right? Yeah. Charges you 10 euros, even though he says it's a gift and it's, but this guy right here, that's the guy. And it's in front of here. There's gonna be many of these kind of guys here. Ah. I can only imagine ah. how many guys there are gonna be like that. But I haven't seen the white masked girls yet. Where's the white, oh, look at that. I didn't even see that. That over here, wow. Is that the shopping mall place? That's the shopping district? Whoa. How yeah. cool is it though, eh? Now it's Mama Nancy's time. So far, it doesn't look like there's so many illegal immigrants. It looks like everybody's a tourist, no? Yes, here and everybody is dressing beautiful. Yeah, so the immigrant thing, I don't know. I don't see it so much. I don't, I don't think so. I don't think, I think that's a false narrative. They said when you come here, it's just going to be covered in these people that just try to... Well, you, you do get the Senegalese dudes here. Are you, this guy's offering the peanuts, I mean, uh kernels for the birds as a gift and all that stuff but i don't know i, I think it's i think it's good i it's think it's beautiful. it's really good all the people are good i don't know that was number one. to finish off my thoughts on uh did this turn into a 
third world country here in Milan. I mean, there is quite a few uh, multicultural people here, I'd say. I don't think it's a bad thing, but if you look, see what I mean? And there, I mean, it's not like anybody's doing it. <laughs> I don't think anybody's doing anything wrong, but <laughs> those guys, see? They're nice guys, see what I mean? Ja, ja. But this is the square. You get a whole bunch of different kinds of people, but this is a highly, this is a tourist destination, like a big time one. So what do you expect? But is it a third world country, Mickey? What, is it oh, true? No, we see that all the lights get gone, huh? <laughs> is it true what they say that this place turned into a third world country? No. I what? Don't know. You it think it's bad though? But it's not, I think Rome was worse. Yeah, well, Rome was, Rome was worse and this is clean here, no? For a big, big city? It is. It's a pretty clean city. And it's, it's nice. Like, look at this place, man. Hey, look at this. So, yes, I don't think it's true. The Instagram post that's saying it's overran. You see all the Palestinian protests, like, ruining everything. Uh, maybe it does happen sometimes when there's a protest, but as of every day, well, I mean, look at it. Look at all the people you see here, right? And if you look, there's lots of people from Senegal and North Africa and Middle East. There is that for sure, but I don't know if it's a bad thing. You guys let me know. You guys think that's a bad thing? Immigration, is immigration a bad thing? Is it ruining Europe? Is it an invasion from within? Is it, is it bad for us? Is it gonna run us out of Europe? Let us know. So yes, overall, I don't think there's a problem here. Uh, we have to go to France to check out, see if there's a problem there, but so far it just looks like a whole bunch of touristing, tourist, touristing. And it looks pretty peaceful and safe, actually, to be honest with you. Not so much going on here in the scam world. So uh, people like a stupid tourist and the honest guy. These guys would have struggle to have content in a place like this, I think. Not so many scams. Pretty good, peaceful place, I think. It's beautiful. There's my bad wife. Um. This is the Bon Jo Show. This is not your show. We have traded the 905 for G O O B. This is Bon Jo Show. Bwah. This is the last of our Italy series and our travel series for this year. Where would you like to see us go next? Greece, Albania, Montenegro, Macedonia? Or would you rather see me go solo to Bangkok and Vietnam? Comment below. Where would you like to see me? Vietnam or the rest of the Balkans? Because I am the Balkan traveler. Should, so should I go visit all the Balkans or go to Asia? Comment below.